Hello everyone and welcome back to another speed build. So um we are back in Vindenberg, yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I just cannot give up on this world because um, this is like the perfect world whenever ever I have some kind of a amazing reference picture or some kind of idea uh, that I want to build, I always ended up here. I don't know why because somehow this world for me has everything that I need uh, when it comes to the, you know, a lot the size and the style and the nature that surrounds these lots are so freaking perfect and I'm always inspired uh, to build in this world and don't mind me please because of that I don't know somehow um, lately I'm so into this like a huge family houses and you see them a lot on my channel I know I have to admit and um, this time around I believe I had like a lot of saved pins on my board on Pinterest and this is one of them. I basically saw one like huge Tudor um, mansion, I can say it's mansion, yeah, and um, I really wanted to build this. Um, I think that you never see me building a Tudor house at all on my channel. Maybe I did some like now CC medieval thing with this like wallpapers, but I use that wallpaper in this through this house a lot, and I decided to, you know, uh, tone down a little bit because it, this wallpaper is way too much, if you're asking me. Um, it's so like you know colorful, uh, even though I used. I don't know, um, this swatch in particular, you have one also that it's very like so into your face. <laughs> I decided not to use that one and I also changed wallpapers um, upstairs. Yes, because this is way too much for me if you ask me. But also I want to add one very interesting thing about this build is uh, that I use those um, add-on, like additional um, windows from a Peacemaker that he actually made, like an extension from, um, I believe, Growing Together, yeah? Where we, where we actually got the Craftsman style, yeah, and Growing Together. And uh, they are so perfect for this house. I don't know why. Don't come for me because I don't know what to use. I, I didn't know what to use basically um, when it comes to the windows. I did add a couple of windows that we got with this expansion pack, but they are way too much for me. Um, and somehow I didn't know what to use else. So this came very handy and I, did, I just didn't want to change them. I don't know, somehow they look so perfect for this house and since this is like a Tudor house this is only like the exterior but inside guys it's totally different story because you know me if you didn't get used to my style I don't know uh, when you are going to do that because this is not going to be old at all you're going to be very surprised if you can watch if you can wait please just skip this part and um, you have chapters over there so you can uh, skip and uh, watch actually what you want in this video and you're going to see the exterior it's totally modern it's so freaking elegant and I decided to turn this like an old-fashioned Tudor house into one spectacular elegant beautiful house um, I use a lot of uh, light swatches light wallpapers because if you know me if you know my channel if you know my style you know how much I love to turn these houses into something new and um, when you are looking this house from the exterior you can say okay um, this is nice but I'm not so into this style I would rather skip this don't worry, you won't skip this house if you want like a perfect family house. This is it. Because the inside is, I don't know, somehow probably one of my favorite um, exteriors. I, I can say that right now because 
Um, I'm thinking a lot about um, the custom content that I'm using and I cut myself into some kind of a rabbit hole <laughs> not rabbit hole, some kind of a loop where I'm basically using a lot of similar furniture and the items I don't want to say furniture the items guys and not just the items um, the wallpapers like everything and I often have um, a very big problem when I'm doing all these houses um, not to furnish them so you you know that story already I talked about this um, last time I believe maybe every single time when i'm doing the voiceover i'm talking about how much i can build and not furnishing those builds it's because um i have a like a huge variety of like different items and different creators and they are all coming up with a new sets but i got myself using like um the same wallpapers all the time because they are perfect when i find one perfect item it doesn't have to be a wallpaper it, ha it can be like um i don't know the kitchen for example um i got myself using this um coastal collection by harry a lot i don't know maybe it's because of the houses maybe it's because of the set but all these items that we got lately are very handy and um i love using them every single time and like i said um I don't know the brownstone wallpapers um a couple of sets from pieri couple of sets from harry couple of sets from um felix i cannot change them i don't know what's going on maybe because of the houses maybe the house it's basically the reason why i'm choosing very similar um, items lately um maybe because they are like all family houses i don't know what's going on I need to change something that's the reason why i know to switch my schedule and basically um you know release video that i didn't plan to release at that point like i did with the uh, oh my god help me um grim reaper's house that house was supposed to be like a month from now probably i'm not so sure but i decided to you know um, um release that earlier it's because i saw like the some kind of um oh my god what is that i don't know um the, the the same same story all the time because when you're building like family houses you really need to pay attention not to repeat yourself and I'm, I'm i'm really trying guys i'm really trying i'm trying to give it my best not to do that especially because i have like two videos per week which is crazy it's even more difficult to maintain and be different every single time and um, um the exteriors are always different but when it comes to the interior it's a totally different story it's like i don't know maybe it's just me somehow i think they are all the same um i don't know what's going on maybe i got is some some kind of a strange mood thing going on maybe i'm just like you know imagining right now but um when it comes to the exterior interior <laughs> design uh, of this interior i totally love it because i love bright wallpapers bright colors but with some kind of um very uh pop of color not just pop of color uh with some item that it's going to be totally different than everything else in this house and that is actually what i did in this um living room i use beautiful chairs from tuds i never use those chairs armchairs they are basically armchairs and i use those it's so beautiful <laughs> this living room looks amazing because i love to do that why you have to go with um similar traditional every single time uh, furniture we don't need to do that we can always make something interesting and i really do love it bedrooms are basically the same we have three bedrooms and they are pretty much like very normal <laughs> bedrooms if you're asking me <laughs> I don't know now i'm really paying attention to um 
my builds, especially because I know people are downloading them for the gameplay. So I'm really paying attention to everything. And don't worry, everything is functional. Everything is on the... If something is wrong, it's not about me. <laughs> um, I don't know what's going on, but it's not about me. And um, the bathrooms are basically the same in this house. Probably I, at this point, I think I only like recorded two bathrooms. The other ones are basically the same. This is the only one that has like totally different color. That's it. And when it comes to the kids, uh, we have one teenager and one like a smaller kid. We have a boy and a girl. The boy is teenager and he is a rock star. He is like a rocker. He loves dark colors. He loves music and things like that. I use this like a very dark color spot for the girl. I use yellow this time. Yeah. And I love that bedroom. It's so cute. But this bedroom is my favorite bedroom because this is my style. You know that I really love black and I really do love this kind of a style and that's the reason why I went with this very dark colors and moody style because after all this is a Tudor house so the family has to be very interesting if you're asking me and the only thing that we have to that I need to show you it's the girls bedroom and um, the only new creator that I use here uh, it's this like uh, thing for sitting over there. I'm not so sure what's the name of that. Like a bench, yeah. Um, don't worry, every single link is going to be on my Patreon page. And this build is going to also be on Patreon, pa pa Patreon, Patreon page. Oh my god, my language today. And um, on the gallery. Guys, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit the notification bell. I love you guys, and see you next time in my next build. Bye-bye.